breaking news in Maine, where the two-day manhunt for gunman Robert Card is over. The mass shooter found dead of a self-inflicted gunshot wound. The discovery comes two days after police say he killed 18 people, wounding 13 others. Investigators are revealing new details tonight. ABC's Rena Roy is in Lewiston tonight with the latest. A 48-hour manhunt coming to an end Friday night. Police finding the body of 40-year-old Robert Card. Like many people, I'm breathing a sigh of relief tonight knowing that Robert Card is no longer a threat to anyone. Card was found dead from a self-inflicted gunshot wound. And tonight, the city of Lewiston and the state of Maine begin to move forward on what will be a long and difficult road to healing, but we will heal. Authorities had been zeroing in on this river. Card's car had been discovered near the boat launch there shortly after Wednesday's deadly rampage that left 18 dead and 13 injured. Meanwhile, officials releasing the identities of those who were killed at a local bowling alley in the town of Lewiston, then at a restaurant several miles away. So many of the victims leaving young children behind. Arthur Strout was a father of five. People loved him. You know, they just loved him. The youngest victim, Aaron Young, was just 14, killed along with his father, Bill, in the bowling alley. Aaron loved to bowl, and it was something they did fairly regularly and just happened to be... That night, David Greenleaf and Lisa Osgood also were inside the bowling alley when gunfire broke out. Lisa's best friend, Trisha Aslin, was killed while trying to call 911. David says he saw the suspect drive away past police. I thought maybe someone got out and was leaving, but they drove so casual. Turns out it was him. ABC News has learned Card's sister told investigators she thought her brother may have been going after an ex-girlfriend who was frequently in the bowling alley. Sources tell ABC News that authorities found a suicide note addressed to Card's son with rantings and bank information inside, but no specific motive. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.